but that there are actually so many computer science graduates that graduate without actually learning how to code and this is absolutely crazy right now okay i'm just kidding it's not really that serious but it kind of is an issue right now i'm gonna be going over why this happens and how you can avoid this which you should this happens when people end up prioritizing getting academic results instead of getting practical real world experience throughout their academic journey in university when you do not prioritize getting real world experiences either from freelance projects or internships you end up losing very valuable industry experience on top of that there are a lot of issues where students from a computer science degree actually just copies and pastes someone else's homework because it's so easy to copy and paste and it's not like a different degree where you can write things in a million ways. When it comes to coding, it's really just taking the exact same piece of code that works and just copying and pasting into it. And this may work in the short term and they're going to think that, hey, made it through university, but in the long term, it's going to harm. It's going to hurt you as a developer because what's going to happen is you're going to end up not knowing how to code, not knowing how to build projects yourself. And it really just kind of snowballs from there because you can't do it right now. Just imagine the gaps in your knowledge that compounds over time and imagine how difficult it's going to be two years from now when you're in the second or third year of university. And one more last thing that's very important for anyone in the tech industry today is tech is so vast and it changes every single day. So if you don't want to put in the extra work to self-learn and improve yourself outside of university studies, you're going to be left out for sure. Which leads me to my next point on how you can avoid this from happening. Number one, put in a lot of your effort into your school assignments. Number two, put in a lot of time and effort outside of your school assignments. In some terms, always be coding regardless of where you are. You need to actually practice writing code of your own instead of just copy and pasting someone else. So you guys got this. I believe you got it. Just always be coding inside or outside of school. I wish you all the best. Do you know